At what point in your musical life did you decide you want to be a conductor and how tough was it at the beginning? What challenges did you face? I wanted to be a conductor since I was like 10 years old because at that moment when I was going to concerts with my parents and family, it looked, it seemed to be the easiest of all the things that I was watching. Everybody was struggling playing instruments around and there was just one person beating and waving beautiful gestures and I thought that was the easiest thing until um, I got more serious in my studies and, and got the chance to to go to university and study conducting, which was a bit tough because there was not such a thing in Venezuela as a conducting faculty. But it was created and things were getting more and more difficult, but not impossible and fascinating career. It's, it's a beautiful career. What advice would you give to a young musician who aspires to be a conductor? Continue to play your instrument properly and master it and have curiosity on those instruments that you don't play at all. If you are a string player, we'll go for be curious about wind players. And if you can attend rehearsals and listen to what conductors are saying, uh, even if you don't agree with them, you might learn sometimes what not to do. What are your six desert island discs? Tosca by Puccini. Um, Queen, Greatest Hits, Bohemian Rhapsody, for example, um, uh, Beethoven's Symphonies, particularly Pastoral and Number no. 7, Cecilia um, Bartoli, uh, Ari Antiche, for example, I don't know how many I have got already, um, some salsa might do uh, to move the hips and to dance and a bit of uh, Venezuelan folk music, traditional music is nice. What do you like most about the programme you'll be performing with us on Monday? It's very much based on dance, uh, the whole programme is about dance and about Latin American. It starts with the symphonic dances, Rachmaninoff symphonic dances and then we travel to Argentina to explore the wonderful uh, Ginastera Harp Concerto. And then we are going to travel to Mexico and we are going to do Danzón. So by the end of the concert we should all be waving, dancing and moving our hips. We are also going to perform a piece, a new piece by a composer from the school um, that I'm really looking forward to work with because uh, I will have some other people that would love to conduct and ask some questions and answer, you know, we will have a kind of a question and a Q&A um, session about the score, the new, the premiere of this score.